Hello, 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 everybody. This is Richard with the Classic Gamers Guild. Rich Kale here on YouTube. Rich Gen X other places. And it is time to put on our Stetsons and load up your six shooters because we're going back to Slaughter Gulch. Now, if you remember from our last episode, we had just gotten into, um, looks like a hotel. As we just dove through the window there. Now let's, uh, go for it. There's Emily! And that didn't look good. And here does that hole in front of us. Custom jewelry right now. I don't think we can jump that hole. I guess it means that one. Let's double check. Anything else here? No. It's locked. Let's light this one here. Uh, that spirit must have had something to do. Or just some information. Alright. Let's go in this room. Miner's Gazette, July 4th, 1864. A year ago, the Arizona kid was shot in the back by a pitless fast Jared. Since then, a legend spun by drunken fools claims that the kid returns to haunt the spot where he was murdered in midnight during the vulture song. Okay, and I think that cuckoo clock didn't have a cuckoo, it had a vulture. That's not a good sign. Definitely not a good sign. Well, these fools and liars say that the kid's ghost then enters a picture of him painted in his blood. They also say that he then can be followed. <laughs> well, considering what we've been seeing so far, I think there's some truth to that. Uh-oh. Yeah. in the right place. Okay, so far I haven't been hit. There we go. I want a token, yeah. Night valet might be useful. What's this here? Flask. All right. No, well, if that's his picture. Hmm. Hmm. There's someone. There. There's a statue. Looks like it might be holding something. All I have to do is hit the right. Make the right choice here. Here? Anything, Edward? 
No. Okay. Hmm, that was a pretty gruesome sight, I'll tell you that. Oh, we can still go through it, though. Alright. Well, let's see what's in here. You backed up, Edward. Why? <sighs> okay. Okay, I can't go down the steps. Well, that might need the door is locked. Why is this door locked? door is locked. Okay. So there's something to do to unlock a door, I think. Door number three, I can't open it. There's something over here. Nothing here. Alright, do I have something I can use to unlock a door here? No keys. Okay, what was the trick to opening that door? Hmm. Ah, you have to look for a point in the right direction or something. Let's see, is there a door somewhere that got unlocked or something? This door is locked. <sighs> is it this door? Door is... <sighs> Let's try again. Missing something. What? Let's see, did I miss something?
Hmm. <clears throat> Missing something. Our key I'm supposed to find or something. Well, I have a feeling I missed something here, and I can't fi find it. June 21st. Hollywood stars are such spoiled brats. Today I learned that Billy Silver demanded to be paid by Hill Century in gold ingots. Yeah, that's a little bit out there. June 24th. The San Andreas Fault slipped, producing an earthquake towards the end of the evening, as Brett Samuels was dismantling the projector near the ravine. May God have pity on his soul. In all my life, I have never heard such a scream. Shame. June 25th. Jeff Davis and another stuntman went down to the bottom of the ravine, but they couldn't find Samuel's body. Billy Silver refused to come out all day. He stayed in the bank, convinced that the ghosts of the Slaughter Gulch prospectors are after his gold ingots. Ay vey. June 29th. Something horrible's going on in this town. Maybe Billy Silver was right. His death this morning in front of the saloon was no accident. We all saw that thing jump off the balcony and stick its fingers in his head. Oh boy. July 3rd. I'm now alone in this town. With Morrison the gunsmith who's hiding God knows where. The others are all dead. I don't have any hope. Yeah, you got hope. Carnby's here. Hmm? What's this here? Danger! Beware of explosions! Keep these reels away from heat and magnesium flashes! Hmm! Okay, that could be helpful. What did I hear? Hmm. That don't look like the eye. It's missing an eye. You know, that looks more like the eye than... Let's see. Hmm. 
More bullets for a Winchester. That Winchester's gonna come in very handy. Hmm. That door is open. So something tells me... <clears throat> I'm highly sus... Oh, we're above the saloon, I think. Yeah, we're above the saloon. Hmm. I'm going to put that right there. What? Uh, you can't put that here now. I have a feeling this is going to be quite needed here. Uh, all right. Hmm. You know, I'm just suspicious of that door, and I think I have good reason to be. Saving real quick. Oh! Alright. There's somebody in there. So... It's going to be is useful right there. Of course, the trick is getting by. All right. Oh, that's the truth. Yeah, he fell to his death and, uh... I'm surprised that that valet is still standing there. Shutter release and flash and instruction seats. All right, let's read that. Hmm. Hmm. Something tells me something gonna go boom. And uh, let's see. Something is missing from the shutter release. Yeah. A bulb. So this is all set. The flash is red. 
ready. The door is locked. Locked. I went to open. Uh, let me guess. The key is used elsewhere. Okay, why is a picture of one-eyed Jack and his crew there? Yeah, I don't like that. All right. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. That must mean something, and we will have to keep that in mind. I haven't 
seen that matchup scene yet. All right, since we got rid of our friend, the uh, ugly, the double ugly. What do we got here? Is it a player piano? Well, if it's a player piano, we could put a token in it. Can't use that here. No, but the slot's over here. With winter came another man. He told Jed Stone about his plan. Mm. Your mountain does a treasure hold, greater far than yellow gold. That don't sound good. In spring the convicts came to town, compelled to dig below the sacred ground. Never dig below sacred ground, that only leads to trouble. Compelled to turn by might and main, the land beneath into a drain. Jed Stone's next consideration was to build a railroad station. Well, that would get supplies there. And while his men toiled underground, the iron horse pulled into town. The company must realize that Slaughter Gulch is paradise. So Jed Stone built a water tank, and rode that train to the rich man's bank. Hmm, that's worrisome. Okay. Hmm. No. Target open. Interesting. in here? A flask? A war stick? War stick is not good. This doesn't work any kind of... Well... It's our only way down. Okay, everyone, cross yourself or do whatever you want to wish for good luck. We're gonna need it. Shoot, here I am alone in the dark. <sighs> uh oh, bats, bats, bats are not good. section of the game. And I think with this, before we approach this, you know that we're at like 28 minutes, we are going to call it quits here for today. And on our next installment, we'll work our way through here and find out where we come out at. Something tells me it's going to be in a mess of trouble. This is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Richer than Classic Gamers Guild on Facebook, Rich Gen X other places, and I invite you to subscribe to the channel and check out some of the other playthroughs. I have been working my way through the Alone in the the original Alone in the Dark series, and you will find a full playlist on the channel here. And there may be other games that I'm playing that you have memories of or are curious of, and you can check through the playthroughs there. And until next time, I wish you all a good day, and I wish you all to take care. Have a good one. Oh, before I go, I better say, right? <laughs>